Now at five, a brazen rash of robberies. Today, we are learning new information about the armed and masked thieves stealing vehicles from car rental agencies at Philadelphia International Airport. Police say there have been 35 incidents since January. Friday night, the big story on Action News is the new details about the bold car thefts. Officials are still looking to track down the thieves behind these incidents, and police say they've become more violent. Action News reporter Bob Brooks live at Philadelphia Police Headquarters tonight with the latest on the investigation. Bob. Yeah, Shari and Rick, look, this is a big, big problem. Police say at first these suspects were stealing these cars in various methods that didn't involve guns. Well, now it seems like they're using guns all the time, and police are worried that someone is eventually going to be shot or even worse. This incident, one of many, is disturbing. It was last month. A suspect pulls up to the attendant at one of Philadelphia International Airport's car rental companies, pulls a gun, and drives off with three others following. All of those cars belong to the rental company. They were stolen. It's a trend that Philadelphia police say is growing rapidly. Well, it's escalating. You could see it's escalating, and uh, it's, it's obviously violence is now the threat. So it's certainly something we want to end very quickly. Police say this started at the rental companies at the airport back in in January of this year. According to investigators, thieves come to the airport in groups of two to six, knowing that the keys are in the rental cars and use various methods to steal the cars from the lots after gaining access to them. Some of these other ones, they would just crash right through the fence. That car would become disabled, however the fence would open and they would leave. But the company's up their security, so now the suspects are using guns to get away. Detectives say five recent point of gun auto thefts have taken place. And typically, the cars wind up somewhere in southwest Philadelphia. And through investigations, 17 of the 23 cars that were successfully stolen have been recovered. But police say it keeps happening, and they're worried at some point an employee of one of these companies is going to get hurt. In all these cases, we believe the individuals we see are about 16 to 22 years of age. And Rick, we saw in that video just how brazen these auto thefts have become, be, have become, excuse me. And again, no one has been hurt just yet. Police fear that could change. If anyone out there knows who they are, you're urged to call the Philadelphia police or 911 immediately. For now, reporting live outside Philadelphia Police Headquarters, Bob Brooks, Channel 6, Action News, Rick. All right, Bob, thank you.